Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So in this video, we gotta do a speed test of the forgotten iOS device, the iPod Touch 7 generation. Yes, I don't see any buzz of this phone of this device, man. You know, even though this thing launched, uh, it, it got iOS 14. Nobody really talk about it that much. So here I am, probably the only person that's doing this. So in this video, we're gonna do a speed test of iOS 13.6.1. I think I have 13.6.1 here. Yes, I did right there, 13.6.1. And we're gonna do a speed test with iOS 14.0.1. Now you guys may be asking, why I don't have any content of iOS 14? I actually do have it on this iPhone 8 here. I have iOS 14, oops. All right, see there, I do have iOS 14.2 right now, actually. Look at that, 14.2. I already tried to make a video of it, but you know, with these times, it's just the video is not, I don't know, man, for me, it's not interesting. Plus, I I really hate this, all right? Y'all people appreciate this. I hate this app library, all right? But it is what it is. So, without any further ado, um, we're gonna do a speed test of starting the iPod up and then opening up some apps and then we're gonna do the same thing with iOS 14. Okay, now with the iPod Touch turn off, we're gonna divide this video into two, so bloop bloop. Okay, because we are not rich men with two iPod Touch 7 at the moment, okay? So, left, 13.6.1 and the right boy is 14.0.1. Okay, so we're gonna start the app, start the test by turning the phone, the device off, on and on, which one's faster, and then app speed test, Apple apps and uh, app store apps, and then Geekbench test and battery test at the end. Okay, so we're gonna start by turning the device on here in three, two, one. cleared up we're gonna open up geekbench and let's see which one scores better and which one takes longer in three two one
So guys, now we gotta go to the battery test. Now, one thing that I realized doing this battery test is that Geekbench 5 doesn't have the battery benchmark anymore. So they downgraded the feature, yeah? Uh, so it's, fo it's fooling your, your the user here. So we gotta download, so we have downloaded the Geekbench 4 thing I already purchased in the first place. Here it is. So let's see, history, battery, top here 14.0.1 down here is 13.6.1 i see 13.6.1 14.37 13.6.1 right there and look at that the graph is one hour and 23 minutes man <laughs> one hour you can see here also every time every minute when it drops so it drops to one percent oh for two hours my bad two hours and 24 minutes so that's a good you know, uh, screen time for the iOS 13. Two hours and 25 or 24, my bad. And the score, oh, much lower score here, 14.0.1. Let's see what the hell is going on. You can see there's the chart. And it goes down. It goes down and down and down for two hours and 20 minutes, huh? So... Let's see here, it's 2 hours 16, so it stays on 1% for 3 minutes, and let's see it, I was 13 here, it lasted 1% for 4 minutes, okay, so a little, a little mix here. So basically, um, battery on iOS 13.6.1 and iOS 14, I can guarantee you guys will get your beautiful, beautiful 2 hours and 20 half, 20, 2 hours and 30 minutes maybe of screen on time jesus christ <laughs> but there's the ipod battery man i mean i can't do anything right that's uh that's what apple gave the battery well that was interesting um actually you know when i was trying to do the speed test opening in opening you know i have to redo it like five six times because you know i keep keep pressing on random things and i do do try one on ios 14 and when i try to open up the camera it crashed and i mean you guys can see when i try to open the camera it just takes a little more longer to actually get it to focus and everything this is actually 14.0.1 the fixed one that should be for the iphone 7 plus that has the blank camera so i don't know what's that but there's that so far there it is ios 14 on the ipod as you can see here we got the widgets and uh, we got the i hate the most app library i never opened this man my, I mean, I have my 11 Pro, which is recording this video right here, and I haven't updated it at all. It's still on 13.7, yeah. And I'm planning to keep it on that, because it will be a rare device, man. It will be a rare device. So, that's it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed the video of the speed test of 13.6.1 and 14.0.1 on the iPod Touch 7 generation, okay? And, yeah, nobody really covers about this device, man. Poor baby. Poor baby, okay? And I will catch you guys on the next video. Peace out.